Good day all, this is TJ the Park Bopper. Today we're coming to you from Kobe Steakhouse. This is on 192 and 1 in 13 locations in the area for Kobe's Ichabod. We're gonna go ahead and have dinner. Today is my daughter's birthday, so we are celebrating that. And uh, we are going to be sitting at a grill, of course. Let's do it. Jeannie, by the way, she's up from Greenville. I want chicken and steak. Let's get one or the other. Why don't you get chicken and you can have some of my steak? Oh, okay. Well, and then safe. Jenny's getting steak. Vegetable delight. Vegetable. Sea bear's getting vegetable delight. Kathy's getting chicken. chicken. I am getting a vegetable delight as well because I really like the vegetable. All right, guys. So my daughter volunteered to uh, give me one of her pieces of spicy, uh, spicy tuna sushi. Wow, there is a good amount of spice in that. Tuna's fresh, you got that acidity. You don't get a lot of the nori flavor in it. So there's not, it's not that kind of salty nori flavor as much. It's more about the tuna. The, they used a really good amount of vinegar on the rice. So all in all, pretty good sushi from that piece that I can, uh, can't make a full a full recommendation on it, but it's pretty good. Jump right in here and just talk a little bit about the soup. I didn't get a video of my trial of it, but just to let you know, it is mushroom based, but it also has chicken and beef broth mixed in it. So it is not vegetarian, but it was very tasty and some of the best soup I've had. All right, guys, so our salad course came. I'm go ahead and give this a shot. Usually love this. The uh, ginger orange dressing is really my favorite. I have two bottles of this at home actually. There's a little bit more um, spice to this one than the Mikado that I eat at home, but really good. I wanted to go ahead and jump in a little bit and talk about the chef. He was very efficient, very entertaining. Always kept the table going, interacted with the whole table, um, was very steady, and uh, yeah, just a great, great chef. All good, all bad. Not all good. The teardrop. All right, guys, so let me give a shot to my man's fried rice here. Here we go. Perfect salt, saltiness. Um, you can really taste the butter. Really good. Where was the fire? It was over there. And it became a train. 
of the steak here. I'm going to give this a shot cooked medium. We'll see how this is. It's sirloin. It's very tender though. Um, right on medium. Just an excellent, excellent steak. Guys, we just finished our dinner here at Kobe. All in all, it was pretty good, pretty good food. Really enjoyed the uh, chicken and the steak. Uh, was excellent. Vegetables were pretty good. Um, as I ate more of them, there was a little bit of bitterness that I really couldn't pick up in the vegetables, but overall they were pretty good. Definitely preferred the rice over the noodles. And as you saw, the show was impeccable. Uh, the whole experience, you can see that they had uh, seen my daughter happy birthday and given her a free cupcake. So that was excellent. Pretty good uh, meal to kill some time after a long day at the park where you just want to sit down and have a nice meal with your family. Definitely uh, a good recommendation is here at Kobe Steakhouse. So again, I am TJ the Park Bobber. If you love what I do, please bob, job, like, and subscribe, and I will see you again soon. Have a great weekend. First thing for your birthday, going to go get your hair done.